This video shows how you can register in the system and do the online application for admission into the six public universities. Remember, in addition to meeting the general requirements for the application, which you will find on the application website of the National Council for Higher Education, CHE, you must also fulfill criteria for each university, faculty, or school as outlined on each program on the university's website. Be sure to visit the websites of the six public universities to review the specific program requirements before beginning your application. Please make sure you have a scanned or electronic copy of your notification of results before you start the online application process. Here's the easy, efficient, and reliable step-by-step -step application process. First, log on to the NCHA website www.pus.nche.sc.mw You can also access the application link from the websites of all the six public universities. You will be greeted by this page. On this page, you can go to explore programs to see available programs in each university and guidelines for the online application. You can also go to the Frequently Asked Questions FAQs if you have any questions. Under the Explore Programs tab, you can browse by university or by discipline. If you are ready to apply, click on the red Apply Now button and you will be taken to another page where you will be required to create an account by registering. Here, you will be required to provide your details such as first name, surname, phone number, email address, and username. You will also be required to create a password. Please make sure that your names are appearing exactly as they are on your notification of results. Once you enter all the required information in their respective fields, click on Register and you will be redirected to the login page. Please use the details you entered in the previous page to log in. On the next page of your application, you will be required to enter your personal information such as gender, date of birth, phone number for next of kin, country of origin, and postal address. On this page, you will also be required to enter details about your latest qualification. When done, Click on Save Information and click Next. On the next page, you will be required to enter your grades. Use the drop-down menu to select a particular subject on the left and its corresponding score on the right. After entering the grades, save and click Next to proceed to the next page. On the next page, Please indicate whether you have any type of special needs. If you do not have any type of special needs, click on No and then Save and click Next. If you have any type of special need, click on Yes and indicate what type of special need you have. Note that you will also be required to provide a medical report. When done, please click Save to save your progress and click Next to proceed to the next page. On the next page, you will be required to indicate your program choices. Remember, you are required to provide a maximum of six choices from the pool of programs. Also, take note that you can only choose a maximum of three programs from one university. The online system will bring you program suggestions based on your grades. Note that the system helps you to only access academic programs that you qualify for based on your performance in MSCE, IGCSE, and other qualifications, thereby increasing your chances of being selected to the programs of your choice. At this stage, you will also be required to upload your notification of results or certificate. After uploading your notification of results or certificate, save 
and click Next to proceed to the next page. On the next page, you will be required to declare that the information you have entered is correct. By clicking on Submit Application, it means you undertake to comply with the rules, regulations and decisions of the universities. On this stage, the system will prompt you to confirm your details by showing you a summary of your application. If everything is alright, click on the Submit Application button at the bottom of the screen. If not, please go back and edit whatever you need to, because once you submit your application, you cannot edit it. After you confirm your submission, you will be taken to a page about payment instructions. Please take note of your invoice number, because you will use it when making your payments. Please note that you can download the invoice by clicking on Download Invoice button. You will be required to pay an application fee of 15,000 kwacha through TNM Mpamba, Unayo, Centenary Bank, Eco Bank, FDH Bank, National Bank of Malawi, NBS Bank, and Standard Bank. The payment can be made electronically or at the participating banks. You can also download a summary of your application by clicking on Download Application Form button. After doing this, you have successfully submitted your application for the 2024 Public Universities Selection. Start your journey to higher education and your dream career today. Apply now and pave the way for a brighter future at one of Malawi's esteemed public universities.